Hi, my name is Bianca Ware. I'm a member of Sunshine 2.0 of RIT and NTID. Today, we're going to be learning how to drum. By the end of this workshop, you will be a drummer. All of us can play the drum with the application of technique and understanding of rhythm. Drums are a great instrument to learn the foundation of music, especially for deaf and hard of hearing individuals. Playing the drums has its benefits. Drumming can be a part of any occasion and bring the community together. It lifts the mind, body, and soul allowing you to express creativity. Most importantly, it helps your cognitive abilities, such as math and memorization skills. For this workshop, we will be doing the following exercises. Two-tone rhythm, intensity exercise, and we will be learning an African drumming technique called cuckoo. I'm so excited. Let's get started. Take a minute to find in your home anything with a flat surface and a hollow space beneath. For example, a bucket, a stool, like what I'm going to use, or a coffee table. Now you've got your drum. The first exercise is understanding a two-tone rhythm. We can produce two different sounds, the high tone and the low tone. The high tone uses the fingers to hit the rim of the drum. It looks like this. The low tone uses the palm of the hand to hit the hollowed center of the drum, like this. All right, let's practice these two tones. Hit the high tone eight times, then hit the low tone eight times. We'll try each tone two times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 Good job! You understand the two tones and rhythm. Good job! Next question. How can a deaf person notice the difference in sound or volume? Surprisingly, your facial expressions and body language can replace that. I'll explain. It's all about the intensity of how you play the drums. Two key points, facial expressions are emphasized with the high and low tones, replacing the sound difference. Two, your body language changes with the transition between tones. I want you to sit upright, back straight, relax your face as you gently play the high tones on your drum. Slowly lean forward. Contort your face with furrowed brows and play the low tone harder and faster, like that. Let's do it together. Yep. 
Let's try a new African drumming technique called cuckoo. I will break down the rhythm into five parts. For each part, I will add to the previous parts. And by the time we put all the parts together, you'll understand the rhythm and will have memorized it. For the first part, we'll create two quick beats in a high tone. Try it with me. We will repeat it a few times. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Good. After the first part, there's a pause and then a repeat of the two high tones. It looks like one, two, hold, one, two. Let's try it together. One, two, hold, one, two. One, two, hold, one, two. One, two, hold, one, two. All right, you've got the one, two, hold, one, two. Now you will add a single low tone beat right after, like this. One, two, hold, one, two, and. Again, one, two, hold, one, two, and. Good. After the single low tone, we return to the high tones. We hit the rim two more times. One, two. Let's try all of it together. Ready? One, two, hold, one, two, and. One, two, again. One, two, hold, one, two, and one, two. Good. Now for the final part, we will add five low notes. On paper, it looks like one and two, three, four. Visually, it's like this, one and two, three, four. Now let's put together everything and you've got cuckoo rhythm. Let's put together everything from the top the full cuckoo rhythm. First, I will do it slow with the full counts, one, two, three, four, etc. And then I will play the regular beat with no signing and no stopping. Ready? One, two, hold, one, two, and one, two, one, and two, three, four. One, two, hold, one, two, and one, two, one, and two, three, four. One, two, Hold, one, two, and one, two, one, and two, three, four. Amazing! We've covered two-tone rhythm, intensity, and a traditional West African rhythm. I'm so proud of you all. I challenge you to record yourself playing cuckoo and to share it with us. Thank you so much for joining my workshop today. Don't forget to sign up at this link. I'm Bianca from Sunshine 2.0. See you next time. Bye!